Congratulations, everybody. Christianity and the Catholic Church, it's so easy to follow. I mean, Jesus said all you have to do is love. That's it. And then you can do whatever you want. Just love. Not really. Just love. That's what people tell me a lot in the comments of my YouTube section, on social media. Anytime they don't want to follow the rules of God or follow the commandments, they said Jesus said it was all about love. And the only thing I say is, where did he say that? Where did he say that in the Bible? Just show me one place where Jesus said it's all about love. Just show me one place, one single solitary place where Jesus said all you have to do is love. Because he never said that. And in fact, Jesus said something the opposite. He said, love is sure, it's important. In fact, it's the most important. But he said the most important thing of all is loving God. Loving God is first and foremost the most important thing in our life. He said that and that alone was the very first commandment, the most important commandment. Only after you love God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, then you love your neighbor as yourself. Those are the two top commandments that Jesus said, love God and love your neighbor. But here's the thing. Jesus said, how do you love God? Matthew 19 says, you know you will love God if you follow the commandments. How do you get to heaven? By following the commandments. Now look at the first letter of John, chapter 2. It says, we know we love God if, if, we keep his commandments. We know we love God if we keep his commandments. We know we love God if we walk in the light. We know we love God if we love our brother. We know we love God if we stay on the straight and narrow and we abide in him and do all the things that he commanded us to do. Then we love God. See, love isn't just a feeling. Love isn't just a nice thought like, oh, I want to I just love everybody so I can do whatever I want now. No, true love of God is following his commandments. That's what the Bible says. It's obedience to him. It's surrendering to his will. It's having a relationship with him. I mean, God wants a relationship with us. Some people say they just love, but they don't even pray to God. They don't even have a relationship with him. I don't even know what that means. They just love. In fact, they probably just love the way they want to be loved. But in order to follow God's commandments, we need to love the way he loves as well. And so that, in, that includes all of our life, the way we walk, the way we talk, the way we have relationships with other people. It's all got to be godly. See, here's the bottom line. Jesus said, if we love God, we'll follow the commandments. He said, we will pick up our cross and follow him, meaning we're going to suffer and we have to offer that suffering up to him. Jesus also said we need to be obedient and we need to follow the will of God and do what he commands us to do. And if we don't, we can't go to heaven. So here's the thing. It's not just about a feeling of love. It's about being obedient to God. It's about giving ourselves to God. It's about following him the way he wants us to. That's what Jesus taught. It's about truth. People forget truth. If you have love without truth, what is it? And if you have truth without love, what is it? You need both. We need the truth of God and what he teaches, but we also need the love of God to follow what he teaches without being all sad about it, without being despondent or down or grumpy or aggravated or irritable or belligerent. I mean, those who love God find his commandments pleasing and joyful. So just loving, it's a myth. Love is not the only thing we need. The Bible says we need faith, we need hope, we need love, we need obedience, we need surrender, and we need to follow God's commandments and his will. Only then can we get to heaven and consider ourselves truly Christian. Thank you for watching. Please like this video if you found it helpful. If you'd like to see more of them, please subscribe to my channel. And as always, put a comment down below and share it with others. Thank you for watching and God bless you.